everybody, welcome back to the channel and to a brand new FIFA 21 video. This is Leo here bringing you another special player review, another Friday, another Path to Glory team. And Team 2 is looking spicy as heck, guys. What a fantastic team EA have released and definitely expect a lot of reviews today. So make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of these Path to Glory content. Uh, they released a Lucas Hernandez and Iniesta Grealish. But we're going to be looking at team number two. And we're going to start with Ante Rebic. Yes, the Croatian legend gets himself a Path to the Glory card. I am on King Albloshi's account. He asked me to open his pack. And we ended up getting him a team two player. And that's why we're bringing in this incredible review to you first, guys. I'm sorry, Leandro Paredes. Argentinians always go first. But but we're going to take turns and review this incredible Croatian left winger. He's 6'1", high, medium, right footed. Four star skill moves, four star weak foot. Looking fantastic. And now once you get into the attribute details, you're going to see why this card is going to be wanted. Because Serie A, I believe he has, they have Insigne, Flashback, what's his name? Sharawi as well. And now you can add Revich to the list of fantastic wingers in the city uh, but obviously we're not going to be playing him in that position guys we are going to be playing him at, at strikers in a 4-3-1-2 we're going to be testing out his finishing abilities i have played before with revic and as i'm looking at the screen croatia is tied 1-1 with shed republic hopefully they can turn that around and this card can go up in value but let's stop talking about that let's talk about the attribute details first a 97 pace 94 acceleration 99 sprint speed phenomenal pace right there for a 6-1 player to have basically maxed out pace says a lot about the card onto the shooting of 93 90 attack positioning 93 finish 99 shot power 92 long shots i did apply a finisher chemistry style mostly to increase the agility and balance and basically max out the finishing on this card onto the passing of 86 he has decent passing for a forward 86 vision, 88 short passing, 93 curve. Good stuff for there. Good enough for me for the one-two touches for my team. Onto the dribbling of 93. And hopefully he does not feel clunky, guys. He does have 87 agility and 80 balance. And like I said, guys, that's why I applied a finisher chemistry style on this card. 96 ball control, 94 dribbling. Insane stuff as well. And lastly, the physicality of 92. And what makes him the Croatian tank? 90 stamina, 93 strength, and 97 aggression. That is insane if you ask me. And lastly, the player traits, technical dribbler. Guys, when have you seen a 6-1 player, aside from like Cristiano Ronaldo, to have the technical dribbler trait? That is amazing if you ask me, and I'm going to have a lot of fun with this card, hopefully. And we're going to be seeing how good this card is and if you should pick it up on your Serie A side or not. A lot of questions to be answered, so let's get on to the review. Game number one against a five in the back player. You love to see that. He wants to neutralize my boy, my Croatian, a legend. And we're going to see if that defense can stop him. I don't think so because his stats are cracked. And I'm pulling for Croatia at this moment. There's still 1-1. One, one. It's going to be interesting to see if they can pull it around against Czech Republic. All right, Revic has the ball. Let's go. Let's see that 97 pace. Can he get past it? Can he get past it? No, he can't get past Kunde. Ay, ay, ay. Vamos. Lautaro. Revic. On the screen. The debut of the Croatian. Look at that. Se viene. Se viene Revic. Can we get the goal? No, we can't. And the bounce scores it right there. He is offside. But you got to see the burst of speed right there. What a great save by Oblak. And hopefully we can get the next shot. It could be a goal, man. Rodri. Berwan, Berwan, what a beautiful pass to Rebic, and he turns around and does that, draws the foul on Kunde. let's see if he does have good free kick accuracy, 82 free kick accuracy, that's not that bad, let's see if we can get a tres dedos in there, let's see if we can get a tres dedos in there, let's go! Alright guys, game number two, not a lot of highlights in that first game, my opponent had probably dip one, Five at the back. That is how much this guy wanted to win that division rival game. So we're going to try once again with this beautiful right here card of Revic. Let's see that pace. Look at the pace. Ahora se viene. 
Vamos, oh, the movement, se viene de finesse, gol, 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 golazo, that is what I am talking about, that is what Revic can do, guys, only took him four minutes, I know, the last game, he should have probably scored, but, like I said, guys, I only got three highlights that game, I was trying so hard to give him the ball, and every time I did, my opponent would control the CDM in depth one, get the ball back, just pass it around the back, very uh, usual stuff from a rat, but hey, there we go, Revit, first goal, vamos! Look at that movement, se viene Revit, I should have probably ball rolled him or chipped him right there. But he is a constant threat on offense, there we go, vamos. Ahora se le vamos a dar al tiene Barry Wine. Revit! Se viene. Easy goal, easy assist, beautiful stuff from Revic. I learned from my last mistake right there. And he scores the easy, easy finesse shot to the back of the net. Oh my goodness, that had... <laughs> Just not that long uh, finesse right there. Did not work out, and where is he? Oh, he's in the back right there. We're gonna give it to him, guys. Vamos. Davies. Revich. Let's go. Vamos! Oh my goodness, that finesse on the right foot once again outside of the box. Pace off, and we are up 3 2. You're seeing the scoring potential on this incredible Revich card. And I believe he had, a, he had a road to the final that I did review. And he did not disappoint there, and he's not disappointing now, man. Lautaro, vamos. Lautaro is disappointing just a little bit, pero la tiene Rodrigo de Paul. Rodrigo de Paul se la pasa para Revit. Vamos, Revit on the right. Very off balance shot, but still dangerous. And we're going to give it once again to him outside the box. If he stays in good position right there, it does not look like he's going to stay in good position. Where is he? Let's go, Rodrigo. Ah. But that ends the first half four. Path to the glory, Revic is impressing me. He has the three goals in this match, and hopefully we can get pick up a couple of more goals and win this ball game. This card's unfair, guys. This card is unfair. Goal, goal, goal. You saw the finesse right there. And I believe this guy has a hidden finesse shot trade because that... I'm writing down the highlights, guys, but that is how good this card's finesse is. You saw it, man. You don't even have to be facing the goal. He's making the run once again. Let's see the through ball. Aye. Move the goalkeeper all you want. Ah, yeah, yeah. I thought he was going to keep moving and he tricked me right there. That is all user error, but look at the balance. Look at the dribbling. Oh, no, man. What a fantastic card, I was about to do something crazy, but you're seeing the dribbling on display right now. This card, this card's dribbling, he feels like a 5'10 player to be honest. Keeps the ball glued to his foot, you can definitely tell he does have the technical dribbler trait. He made that good run, the AI run right there. I'm on Revich, if he scores I'm done. I'm out guys. So Revic did not come here to play, guys. What a fantastic card. And I am Googling right now. Did they beat Czech Republic? No, they didn't, guys. Ah, ja, ja. His price is going to crash tremendously. And it looks like he is probably not going to get upgraded unless uh, they get a favorable score against Scotland because they did lose to England. Czech Republic does have four points at the moment of this recording. So... Definitely, Croatia is going to be rooting for England to beat Czech Republic. That is unfortunate, guys, because this, fan, this card was fantastic. And unfortunately, like I said, guys, with the results, it's not looking likely. And that's why he's about 80k at the time of this uh, recording. His biggest pros, guys, though, if you're still on Milan fight, you need to pick up this card, guys. 97 pace, obviously. The 93 finishing, the 99 shot power. Good stuff there, guys. Also, the 96 ball control. I like it. The 93 strength, the four-star, four-star. He has everything you want in a striker. So... So if you do not uh, like, uh, let's say, shorter players such as Insigne or Sharawi, definitely go pick up this Revit card. It is fantastic. And hopefully, uh, uh, what's it called, Croatia can step it up and get some Ws, man. Because 
they are leaving us disappointed but anyways guys i will go straight into the meta rating meta rating this car is going to be an 8.5 out of 10 you do feel that agility and balance just a little bit and then final rating will be an 8.5 out of 10 as well guys i really enjoyed this card and he tore it up in that second game carried my team to victory and hopefully that uh thing can happen in your squad if you do end up picking them up but before I let you go, guys, I just want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. I have been killing it with the support, and I love seeing that, guys. Please take a second out of your day, like this video, subscribe to the channel, and expect more reviews later on today. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye and good night.